that's the Cytoxyl rifle video. You guys wanted this for a while, so let's get into it. Base rifle is built on a PSA 16 inch M lock railed upper with a mil spec Anderson lower. Cry about it! The stock is the Magpul Mo rifle stock, which has a super large compartment inside for my clean kit. On the inside, I keep Q tips, rifle swabs, some brass brushes, screw and punch rod, and a little toothbrush. Moving forward on the rifle, I have the Magpul Mo grip with a core that allows me to store my CLP. For sights, I have a mil spec carry handle paired with an A2 fixed front sight. I also have integrated Trigicon Tritium Night Sights. I run Gen 2 P Mags with XTAC Green Tip. Charging handle is a Radiant Raptor. Bull Carrier is a PSA full auto rated Bull Carrier group. This will be upgraded in the future as it's something I don't want to skip out on. I have a mil spec trigger and my laser is a D Ball I2 9007. I have the standard tape switch that comes with it and I have that routed through my rail with a zip tie and duct tape. I know you're asking, why is your laser so far back on your rail? It allows the weapon to be way more balanced while still letting me activate my tape switch with my support hand. My sling is a Blue Force Gear AK sling. It works. I have a Surefire M600U Scout Light, the 3D printed anti-reflection cap. On the end of my barrel, I have a Mac V SOG type punch rod, which I already did a video on. That video will be linked in the description. And of course, I always tape the end of my barrel to keep stuff from getting down there, especially in a subtropical muddy environment. Please remember that your rifle is your sword against all evils. Use this time to tune and perfect it, as we never know when we won't have time. 